Hello Galaxy Heroes, Mikey here. So, uh, what we have here, what we're dealing with here, is a total lack of, yeah, no, is um, just a few GAC videos that I did. Uh, my GAC's been topsy-turvy, uh, won't go into a great deal of it. So basically, um, external things have impacted on my ability i use that word very loosely ability um yeah i gax a weird one for me i kind of i'm either in it or i'm not um and sometimes it's really difficult to kind of be in it if that resonates with anyone but anyway i digress um these are just a few so um i think this was me kind of I think I was in a um, like a live session. Uh, we were both hitting at the same time. <clears throat> Sorry, voice starting to go now. Hiccups on the last vid and voice going now. Yay. Um, but this was just like a tit for tat of uh, who could post the higher score. You know, it's over to you, over to you, over to you kind of thing. But actually, that's not quite true because there's a mix up here. Um, so who we got? I've got two Reaver battles in this lot, and I've also got a, a a Jack. Jack for me is Jedi Knight Cal Kestis. There needs to be a a vowel in there. And I'm going for a the first vowel. Oh, the most important, or maybe not. Anyway, um, this was somehow what I was trying to work out where I was going to use Reva, and um, yeah, the prospect of using her against two Jedi was too great, so yay. Um, this one here is just using the Bastilla um, Omi, and yeah, it's kind of a mopping up one. Um, I didn't record every battle, um, and the fun one about most of these is that you get quite a few battles here. Um, none of them really last very long. Uh, so, yeah. Yeah. Um, just remember, just hit her singularly. Don't do multi-hits. Get rid of that taunt. Is it back yet? It's not back yet. Um, I think we're going to now do the group attack aren't we no we're not okay i'm just eking it out for some reason no ability block but yeah i just find it seems to be um easier to just one hit her out the park once she's gone her mechanics or most of them seem to go big bada boom there and we've just got Isla, yes, I can read my screen. Well done, me. Not a Sarge, Isla. They're both blue. One's got no air, and she don't care. Uh, so here's the Jack battle here. So you can see it's a crew, you foo. Yes, yes, you fuck off. And I oh, don't know. No, not that would be UFO, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah. We've got to do something to make it sure it's not suitable for kids. There you go. Mission accomplished. So, I'm tempted, um, I'm facing, a, I've got a battle, uh, obviously a round to do, I haven't started it yet, clock's ticking, but um, I am very tempted to try Jack along with Jack L, or JKL, Jedi Knight Luke. Um, and Mace against Malgus just to see, because I must admit, this dude is is making Jedi fun again. Um, yeah. So are we going to say bye-bye crew? Not yet. There we are. Ta-da! Um, okay, so this one you can see. We're already two minutes into this and I'm just like, oh my God, I've made a mistake. I wasn't sure what to use. So as you can see, it's against Treya Nihilus and uh, an Omi Savage. 
uh, who's Relic 5, and uh, Relic 5 is more than enough of pain in the ass. but we're slowly starting... Oh, there you go. So we're opening things up a bit, and then I'm like, oh, I've got to get rid of Nihilus, because he's going to um, do his Annihilate thing. So it's all panic about Nihilus, and yeah, eventually I'm like, you know what, maybe if we took out his lead, it would nullify him somewhat because he just ain't going is he he ain't going and yeah you gotta love a trier uh that's what's that that's the fall for night eight that he's tried so far on lord vader and lord vader's like yeah nah mate nah nah now nah, you might wear a scary mask but you want to see me when i uh when i step up with my scary mask yes you don't get bricked up doing a voiceover. <laughs> there you go. So um, I was getting a little bit concerned that that was going to end up as a draw. It, it didn't. So I was looking, looking, looking. Is this the one that I think it is? Oh, no. No, this one I just had to do this. It's a <coughs> woman leader or female leader uh, with a couple of droids against a female leader and a couple of droids. So I just, yeah, got to be done, hasn't it? Got to be done. Um, I like the magic trick there. I don't know where she teleported to because she didn't look like she died. She just went. Da -da. I did say that these were quick battles. I uh, had this one was a bit like, oh, what do I use here? And it's like, okay, well, I've got this lot. I've got the Omicron on my first order TIE pilot, FOTP. And, um, yeah, I must have, I was uh, more than pleasantly surprised at the way that they demonstrate knife through butter power. Um, I did say there were two Reva battles. Here's the second one. As you can see here, it's against Radus. Um, yeah, I need to pit my Reavers against, uh, stronger comps, but again, I'd work through, you know, you kind of go with your gut or whatever on, on your counters, and it just hadn't panned out that I was using her anywhere, um, but I've got to be honest, uh, this, this one was kind of like quite, uh, a satisfying, um, battle it's still there wow there you go and now we don't want her to revive so ability block there's nothing left big better boom and there we go i did say that they were quick and i think this might be the last one so this was uh this was me racing through i know that uh I don't think I had full time, which is why the clock's out of skew. Because, um, yeah, left it to the last moments as such to, to do stuff. In fact, I think I, I didn't actually clear their fleet. So uh, this was the second battle um, I had to go against the executor, executor. Piets or Pi TTs, bounty hunters. So I'd already done them, and then this one was just like, oh, I've got to do Empire against uh, against Galactic Republic. I was thinking of doing the uh, the Sith one, the Fury class, and so on, but uh, they don't actually work so well against galactic republic in fact someone placed them i didn't record it should have recorded it where i use my negotiator to take out the uh the fury class with the b28 um kind of stall team or fleet um but this yeah i got in retrospect i know why i did this i did this just so i could bring out tie defender and i could do Houdini tricks and make them all disappear with 
not much effort. See, bye bye. Go on, let's hit you with something. Wow, that worked, didn't it? I don't know what I did there, but wow, he's still okay. As I say, tie defender making them disappear. Of course, you've got to be careful because um, JKA there uh, doesn't miss. So, um, yeah, in hindsight, maybe tie defender isn't you know as safe as safe could be. JKA, um, well, have we got three ships? We've got JKA, um, Vader, and... Hans Millennium Falcon, I believe. The three ships that don't miss. I'll tell you, we could do with some tunes that don't miss. I mean, for the deadliest forces, they all seem to be like stormtroopers and, you know, fire a gazillion rounds and, and hit nothing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shh. Shh. Don't talk about foresight and whatnot. Oh, just bring them out in more data cons everyone gets foresight and if they lose foresight they gain double foresight and then yeah so you just stand there and swish you keep everyone cool by swishing so that's it i hope it was fun thank you for watching